But that was a while ago. I'm not up to date on the narratives. I have outdated knowledge. Uh, going to PS2, the first game. So a lot of the high priority stuff that Pally relies on uh, becomes sort of half invalidated in this matchup. I'm interested to see what the Kazuya counterplay is with high level Palutena play. I.e. you just kind of, you can't like nair at, some, at him while he's on the ground and like get away for free and maybe intangible back airs and dash attacks have some different properties with, you know, the invincibility that Kazuya has. See, right there, that was an intangible back air, but it was one clear through. Uh, and that changes things. Pally relies on that uh, priority. Inches away from connecting. Kazuya able to go deceptively low with his recovery and stall there for a while. Um, but no risk of the edge guard there. Uh, and the charge is gone, which Jen needs. Right, wow. Just goes for it raw. Um, and that takes the first stock, even though Jenna established such a strong start. Wow, I have never seen Rapid Jab kill. I wonder if there was some bad DI there. Dangerous. Yep, that's what I was waiting for. Down smash at the ledge. <laughs> but it just came later than I thought it would. I felt certainly taking the stock at that point. Wow. And that connects too. Uh, Nair combos, which I feel like are pretty, you know, they're exponentially riskier on Kazuya, who has an invulnerable anti-air combo starter. Ooh, bad situation. Already a kill percent. The guy's in, so gets the back air. Didn't want to take the risk on anything further than that. And going off stage. Nope, just going for an up tilt. And he knew. Every Kazuya wants that. Doesn't matter what skill level you are, what proficiency with the character you're at. You want wake up uh, red thing. I can't remember what the red thing is. <laughs> God, I should probably learn uh, some character knowledge. Back air, keeping him off stage. And wow, Jen back in the lead. That was a quick, uncontested 80%. Now 90 That's probably going to be it. Nope, DI's properly. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that really caught me off guard. Further pushing instead of landing. Uh, respect. It worked out for him. There we go. You could see he was trying to mix up the DI a little bit. Jen thought he was safe. He's like, all right, I didn't, I didn't get the hoo-ha DI and die early. But... Guard was lowered. Camera was zoomed in. Hard to pay attention. Hard to react. All right. Here's the narrow swings we need to see more of. Off stage. Yeah. I don't know. I wonder if Jen will figure it out or if it's point, like sort of pointless to go for more of the edge guards rather than set up for a ledge trap. He's still going for it, though. There's out a jab. Oh boy, you don't want that. All right, that's not the worst. 52. Not quite at kill percent. That's a good spot to be in. No resources off stage. Yeah. Oh, wait. I thought there was no jump. Uh, anyway, still living. Wow. Yeah, Skeet is expertly getting back to stage against a character with a hugely active hitbox and a counter and all that. Uh, so not being edge guarded once so far in the whole set uh, on a low recovery is impressive. All right, there we go. I said it. <laughs> I jinxed it a little bit. Uh, reads the roll in with a back air. Well executed by Jen. Skeet really wanted to get out away from ledge as fast as possible uh, and was a little bit too greedy for it. Wow, these spot dodges not serving Skeet well. Just kind of what could have been three separate occasions of ending the combo at 2%. Uh, Skeet just air dodged more and more to get out of it. I'm not crazy about that. I think Jen was def 
definitely trying to stay on stage with that. At the very least, not die. But. Uh oh. Oh, nothing. Down smash isn't that great at low percent of UDI. Right. That is good to know. Waiting for that. Yep. Jen really trying to bait out the grab. Reacts to the fact that it didn't cross up as well. So Jen looking to be in a much better spot. Uh, but, you know, one tilt could change that uh, out of Kazuya's kit. Dangerous. That's going to do it. Wow. Unrelenting. Kazuya... Not the best when it comes to landing options. Jen taking game two. Pretty pretty convincingly. Yeah. It's a two stock. So we see FD and Kalos are banned. Small battlefield, pretty similar setup to PS2. Different blast zones, basically. Um, just keep spamming a couple of combo starter options. Gems still really just want something to work on these. Yeah, keeps threatening the down air. Uh, and Skeet still f really quick to pull the trigger on like neutral get up roll from ledge immediately. Um, and Jen picked up on that last time, so not a great sign that we're seeing more of that from C. Ooh, that should be a lot of damage. Waiting for the air dodge. He calls out a second one, but doesn't quite hit, uh, get the kill with it. That should be. Ooh, that's not a great execution error. Can't be making those against Jen. Turn around grab. Doesn't even use uh, the fully charged one. This is not a great situation to be in when you're doing All right. The down air doesn't connect right there. It was a strong hitbox, which could have led to a lot more. Jen's saving grace. Still going for the down air at the ledge is Jen. Still haven't really seen the proper spike connect. All right. The whiff and the percent racked up gets rid of the charge. And, I don't know, when you're at 97%, that doesn't even make a huge difference uh, against Kazuya. There are plenty of other kill options he's got. Not looking great for Jen. I don't know, when you're a zoner like this, it's, it's hard to really... Oh, that's that. That's so brutal. <laughs> Basically with a three stock. Yeah, that's a hard comeback to mount. Because you can only lose neutral twice. Um... And Palu can get some serious combos going, but you, you need to win neutral, like, you know, 5 to 10, 15 times maybe to steal out of stock. Yeah, up B, even with proper DI, takes that. Jen waiting. Oh, man. Yeah, he was really baiting for that. Just a much, much better version of Kirby waiting at the ledge to neutral be you off stage. <laughs> Good stuff to Skeet, though. It's been fun watching his progress as he improves. Um, definitely being a PR threat constantly. Um.